Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got my introduction for my Finish 7 by Spring challenge. Um, once again, I'm a little bit late with joining into these. I feel like that's just the story of my life, basically. Um, but I've still got two months left until um, spring is here, hopefully. Um, so I thought, why not just join in and... Um, yeah, I've got my products here next to me, so I'm just gonna go ahead and show the products that I want to work on and hopefully finish during this project. So first of all, I got a foundation that I've had for quite some time right now. It's almost finished for quite some time as well. And I don't like it very much anymore. I'm wearing it now and when I look at it in the camera, it, it looks okay, but... Um, Nah, not a fan anymore. I used to really like this when I started using it. Used it all the way up until it was almost finished and then I moved to something else. Um, yeah, so I just want to go ahead and finish this one. Even though there isn't too much in here anymore, I still wanted to put it in here because I'm just not using it if I won't put it into a project, I think. So, um, what is the product? This is the L'Oreal Paris. Um, Infallible, infallible 24 hour matte foundation in the color porcelain, which is the lightest shade, I think, or at least the lightest shade that I could get here in Ireland. And I am about here, I think. I tried to like watch through it with a flashlight and even then it was kind of hard for me to tell where I was. Um, as you might hear from this sound, it sounds extremely empty, so it might just be done after like three or four uses maybe even, but we'll see. Um, so yeah, this is what I'm going to be working on. It's kind of a gimme product because I'm 100% I'm sure I'm going to have this finished in the next two months. But like I said, I won't work on it if I don't put it into one of these projects and I really, really want to get this one out. And then a product that you guys already know and which looks awful at this point. This is an, another Larry L'Oreal product and this is the Made For Me Naturals Brow & Duo Eyeshadow in Blondes. And kind of a sneak peek for my Project 10 pen. Um, this is what I have left of the one shadow that's still in there. And I want to try and finish this up within the next two months. And I think I should be able to. So this is what I'm starting with for this project. Then I've got two lip products that I want to use up. And one of them you've seen before as well. This is my LA um, Girl Creme Lipstick in the color Devoted. And this is all that I have left, so there really isn't too much anymore. Um, it's pretty bright though. And um, I think I had this in my Seven Summer Fling um, project. And even though I tried to use it a lot, I just didn't really succeed because of my colorful... Uh, pen that palettes palette so um, this year I have a more neutral palette so I think I can definitely uh, finish this one also maybe a gimme product because there isn't too much left in here anymore but it's quite pigmented and it stays on the lips pretty well so I won't be reapplying this too much so let's see and then I have a tinted lip balm or well it's not a lip balm per se this is the Ico um, fat balm as they call it because it's for your cheeks and your lips but I think it's too greasy to use on my lips so I would just use this on my lips how many times can you use the word lips in one sentence <laughs> um, anyway this is in strawberry and this is all I have left on that one um, it looks pretty dark in here but I am actually wearing it <laughs> right now and as you can see because it's just a tinted lip balm it's not a like extremely pigmented lipstick or anything it's well extremely wearable anyway so that's what that one looks like and this is what i'm gonna be working on um i've also made my markings for those two but well, there wasn't really any reason to show you them against the markings as there is no progress yet but just so you can see these are my markings for these the Ico one and the LA Girl one. And let's just see what the progress is going to be like by the next updates. And then 
another product that you guys have already seen before. My um, Jelly Pong Pong Supermodel Stain, even though you can't really read that anymore. Uh, broken pa packaging. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna try and work on the pink color this time. Um, another sneak peek for my product and pen here as well, I guess. Um, yeah, I know that I, even though it's an extremely small pen, I need some time to actually work on these. So I'm hoping I can get this finished within the next two months, but I'm not 100% confident. Um, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. So yeah, I just want to get this palette out because, um, as I've said before, cream products, not my thing. And since it's falling apart, I just need to get this out as quickly as possible. So that's what I'm gonna try and do. And then I've got another kind of gimme product in here as well. And this is my MAC uh, Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Light Plus. And this is what it's still in here. So <laughs> there really isn't too much left anymore. I think this is like maybe one or two um, weeks of use, but I just want to make sure I finish it. So I thought, why not just put it in this project and give me a couple um, easier products to give me some momentum while working on them. So as you can see, I've already hit pen here. The pen is kind of starting to show through there as well. So there really isn't much in here anymore. <clears throat> so that will be a nice um, first product to finish, I guess. And then lastly, I've got a perfume. And this is my cher Cherry Mugler, or however you want to pronounce it, perfume in Alien. I really, really love this one. I haven't used this for quite some time because I just didn't feel like using it for a little while. Um, but I recently started using it again and I fell totally in love again. And uh, I marked it with some nail polish because on this packaging you're not going to see any black um, marking. So I just did it this way. This is what I've still got left in here. I think I should be able to use this one. And I really want to use this one up before spring as it is kind of too strong of a smell to use in spring or summer I think most of the time I really really like wearing this one in like fall winter time so I thought I just want to go ahead and finish this one by spring and those are my seven products um, thinking about uploading an update for this about every three weeks although I've got two months so it's gonna be like three weeks three weeks two weeks probably but um, I guess you guys will find out when the next video goes up. Um, and that's it. So if you want to uh, follow my progress and you are not uh, subscribed to my channel yet, don't forget to do that somewhere down below here. And uh, I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.